this week's top five news stories. Number five. India's Spicejet will be the first airline to use the 90-seat version of Bombardier's Q400 turboprop later this year, after it received certification from Transport Canada. In at number four. Mexican ultra-low fare carrier Volaris has started code share operations with the US ultra-low fare airline Frontier. Volaris already flies point-to-point destinations in the United States and Central America, but says its Mexican customers can now visit more US destinations that were not covered before. At 3. Japan Airlines has taken the first steps on its journey towards the planned launch of a new low fare carrier by mid-2020. The new carrier is expected to be based out of Tokyo Airport and will fly mid to long haul routes to destinations in Asia, Europe and the Americas. In Act 2, ATR delivered five more 72600s to Iran Air ahead of the re-imposition of government sanctions by the United States last week. ATR still has a further seven aircraft to deliver from its existing original order of 20 that the airline placed in April 2017. The order was originally valued at $536 million. And our top story this week. Investigations are continuing into the accident that saw an Aeromexico aircraft crash during takeoff. The Embraer E-190 was leaving for Mexico City when it crashed. There were no fatalities among the 103 passenger and crew, although there were injuries. All were able to exit the aircraft before it caught fire in a field on the outer limits of the airport. That's it for this week, but for more news and information, don't forget to subscribe and follow us on social media.